Managers have been urged to evaluate the leadership capabilities, organizational structure and systems they're planning to adopt to get ahead and stay ahead in the face of global disruption. The Director of Current Affairs, TVC Communications, Babaji De Kolade Otitoju, made this known while delivering a lecture on strategic leadership during a program of the Chartered Institute of Management and Leadership held at the Federal University of Agriculture, Abeokuta. Senior reporter Kazim Olowe was there. For an organization or government to succeed, those at the helm of affairs must be ready to adopt strategic leadership approach and ensure other stakeholders key into the vision and work towards actualizing the shared goal. This was part of the suggestions of the Director of Current Affairs, TVC Communications by Bajidi Koladio Titoju, at the program of the Chartered Institute of Management and Leadership held at the Federal University of Agriculture, Abe Okuta. While delivering lecture on the theme of the program titled Navigating the Future, Strategic Leadership in the Era of Disruption, Babajide Otitoju said leaders must be curious, decisive, listen, communicate, diplomatic and have foresight. He also wants leaders to develop the mindset and organizational culture that will turn the forces of destruction into catalysts for strategic thinking and creative execution. The value of leadership, capabilities and organizational structure or systems you need to develop to get ahead and hopefully stay ahead in the face of global disruption. The challenge for you as a leader is to develop the mindset and organizational culture that will turn the forces of disruption into a catalyst for strategic thinking and creative execution. The national president of the institute who was represented at the event also emphasized the need for adoption of strategic leadership in management of companies, institutions, governance, among others. We look at leadership from the position of academics, from the position of political, and from the cultural value aspect, including even the religious aspect. Because the combination of all this it is what can give us what we call a total holistic national development in appreciation of their positive roles in the development of their communities and institutions, the Ebu Mawi of Agoiwi Abdul Razak Adenuba and the Aragwiji of Iragwiji Abdul Rashid Olabomi, represented by Kola Adebayo, the Deputy Vice Chancellor of Development FUNAB, were honored with fellowship awards and inducted as members of the Board of Regents of the Institute. The Vice Chancellor of the Freer University of Agriculture, Abe Okuta, Ulu Shola Kende, who was represented by the Deputy Vice Chancellor Academics, Ulukayo de Akinyemi, was also honored for his exemplary leadership style and commitment to national development. Kazimolowe, TVC News, Abe Okuta.